Hello, Camden High School students and staff. This is your athletic director and head football coach, Coach Rimp. As you can see, I am standing in the middle of Zimp Stadium, hollow ground, 91 years in existence. But more importantly, in a week's time, our varsity football team will have their first home football game of the season. This 2020 season will kick off on October 9th when the Bulldogs take on Lake City, which will also be our homecoming. So we've got homecoming court, we've got the homecoming festivities, our first Friday night home football game. A lot of things to be excited about. Begin! It's about to get real. Where do we sit when we come to the stadium? We are fortunate enough to have a pretty big home side at Zim Stadium. We've got five total sections. Now what we've done this year for all of our season ticket holders and those that have had reserved seats over the past few years, they got first choice to get a seat in section two, three, or four right here in the middle. So section two, three, and four are gonna be off limits to any general admission ticket. If you get a general admission ticket, which is a student ticket, or anybody else that doesn't have a reserved seat, you're gonna be sitting in section one or five, which is on the end. Now, where do you sit in sections one and five? Well, those seats on those bleachers will be taped off. We've got to sit every other row. You sit on the tape. If there's no tape, then you can't sit there. We've got to be socially distanced. Six feet between each group of people that come in. It's about to get real. It's about to get real. We do anticipate our home side filling up, which means we have reached capacity on the home side. Nobody else will be allowed in the gate. Now, a couple ways to uh, make sure that you can get into the game. One is to buy a digital ticket. We're going to sell online tickets this year. By buying the digital ticket, you guarantee yourself a ticket to get into the game because there is a limit. There is a capacity limit this year where we may have to shut the gates. So we encourage everybody when tickets go on sale on Monday, go ahead and buy your ticket so that you can guarantee access into the football game on Friday night. One question we keep getting asked is what do you do with the student section? Where are the students going to sit? Well, with the guidelines we have this year and everybody having to be six feet apart, if not from the same group or from the same household, it's going to be pretty tough to have a student section up in the stands. So Ms. Corner had a great idea. I agree with her. It's a great idea, but we have to be able to implement it with our students. So the idea is to have our students not be in the stands, but have our students a separate section. This is it now, can't quit now, feel the pressure is on the rise. I'm burning inside, energy is high, and I feel so alive. Now the seniors know that there are always certain senior privileges throughout the year. Ms. Corner wanted to make sure that the seniors had a privilege when it came to Friday night football games. So what she's come up with and what we want to try to do, as long as we get the participation, is for our senior students to make their own student section had to face up, so I prayed up, put my head down, and I came up. So what you afraid of, this is what legends do. Right here, in the end zone of Zimp Stadium. The plan is to have the first 50 seniors to sign up on the Google form that will be released on Monday. To have a seat right here behind the end zone on the field as it stated. The made of in the stage of a new wave of hustlers, ballers, and renegades. Every day stay dedicated on a mission until we can say we made it. be a pretty exciting vantage point to see the football game from. You're literally almost in the action. I anticipate when Willis Lane or Jafari Pearson or Leroy Brace or Anthony Lyles or one of our guys on defense scores a touchdown in this end zone that you guys will be right there to celebrate with them. Nothing that life would just hand you Always did what they told me I can't do And it's still all a gamble Go and handle your handle Now with this new opportunity comes high expectations A couple things you've got to do to remain on the field level And to remain in the end zone is you got to behave Can't have any wrestling Anyone not socially distancing We've got to stay near our seats Can't be jumping over the wall Certainly don't want you guys to run on the field and get us a penalty However, we do want y'all to be loud I want you to be excited. I want you to cheer for the Bulldogs. Our guys love it when you're loud. And they love playing in front of a crowd. We expect all you seniors that are down here in the end zone at field level in these prime seats to give us all that. But remember, you got to be behaved. Mask on full time. You got to be socially distanced. Stay by your chairs. Have fun and cheer on the Bulldogs.
ready? ready? Keep your eyes peeled. You hear it coming? It's about to get real. Now next to the 50 seniors will be our homecoming court. Our 50 seniors on the field will be right here. Our homecoming court will sit right over here in their chairs. There's 26 members of the homecoming court, including their escorts. They will sit here also on field level. You guys have the same rules, same reminders as the 50 seniors that will be in the end zone here. Again, I want y'all to be loud. I want you to cheer. Let's have a good night. I can hear the questions now. Our paint crew is wondering, what about us? Where do we sit? Well, we've got an answer for you too, guys. You won't be in the end zone with the 50 seniors or the homecoming court. You'll be in a different spot on the field. Our paint crew will occupy the south end zone. You guys will be down here by the flag, by the bell, by the scoreboard. Now, last year, we got in trouble for ringing the bell. When our guys scored touchdowns, ran over to the bell, they said we couldn't ring it, but somebody else could. We love that bell. We love hearing it ring. So we're going to count on you guys to ring that bell every time we score a touchdown at Zim Stadium. Now, those 24 members and escorts of the paint crew will be down here in this end zone. You guys will need to abide by the same rules as the seniors in the other end zone. Stay near our chairs. Wear a mask at all times. No congregating. Stay socially distanced. No jumping over the fence or throwing things on the field or running on the field. I want you guys to be loud. I want y'all to cheer. I want you to yell. I want you to scream. But in order to keep this privilege going after this first game, Ms. Corner and the administration need to see y'all to be well behaved. We want to keep y'all in the end zone. You've got to prove us right and show us that you can do it. This Friday night, October 9th, the Bulldogs versus Lake City, 7.30 p.m. kickoff. We want to have all of our Bulldog faithful here to guarantee yourself admission into the game. Online tickets are going to sell on Monday. So remember that Monday morning, 8 a.m., our online tickets go on sale for the homecoming game against Lake City. Go online after 8 o'clock, pay you $7, guarantee admittance into the game on Friday night. Where you're going in black, come cheer on your Bulldogs. Let's have a great night. Remember, one team, one town, one goal. Go dogs. You know the deal, it's about to get real.